You may have heard about the taiga, or maybe you call it the boreal forest, but no matter what you call it, we're going to learn about it. There are many things in this forest biome, but let's start off with the animals. The animals of the taiga usually have thick white fur, which keep them warm and blend in. Some of the small, smaller animals are like snowshoe hares, which are like rabbits, but bigger, moles, squirrels, and otters. Some bigger animals are deer, caribou, wolves, and even tigers. All of these animals live in the lovely forest located in Canada, northern Russia, Scandinavia, and Alaska. It has plant life too, like blueberries, oak, birch, and alder trees. There are so many wonderful things to talk about, but this is the end of my presentation. A lake is a still body of water. A river flows. Lakes and rivers are freshwater habitats. Animals rely on these habitats for food and water. Some live in the water, others live nearby. Mammals like beavers can be found in rivers. Reptiles like turtles live in lakes and rivers. Lots of amphibians and fish live in these habitats too. There are more than 15,000 types of freshwater fish. Hope you learned something new about lakes and rivers. Hi, welcome to the coral reef. Coral is a colorful communal animal, even though it looks like a plant. The coral provides shelter for many animals in this complex habitat, including sponges, fish, jellyfish, anemones, sea stars, sea turtles, and much more. Here are some types of coral. Table coral looks like a flat tabletop. Branch coral have the appearance of a spiky tree with smaller branches reaching out. Brain coral looks like the ridges of a brain. Sea fans look like the feathery fans growing at the bottom of the sea. Sea whips branch into whip-like stalks. Finger leather corals look like folded pieces of leather. Here are some fun facts. A quarter of the marine life species live on coral reefs. Half a billion people rely on coral reefs for food. Coral reefs need sunlight to grow, but too much heat can be harmful. They act as a barrier during storms. Hello there, welcome to the tundra. The tundra is located in northern Canada bordering the Arctic Ocean. When you think of tundra, you think of a dry barren wasteland with no plant life, but tundra is better than you think. It is in a cold area and the soil is frozen, but in the summer, short grass and trees grow and a bog comes bringing moss and moisture. Migrating animals such as caribou, moose, and deer migrate here. The animals they are hunted by are wolves and bears, which are eaten by mosquitoes. That is what the tundra is. Hello, I'm Virginia and welcome to the rainforest. Here are some fast facts about the rainforest. The rainforest is home to most of the world's animals and plants, from the tiny praying mantis to the mighty tiger. Only 2% of sunlight reaches the ground. Without sunlight, green plants cannot grow well. Pineapple, chocolate, and cinnamon come from the rainforest. It can take several minutes for a raindrop to reach the ground. I hope you learned a lot about the rainforest. Goodbye!